Everybody, welcome back to some Mech Warrior. Uh, let's get started then, or we'll view. Uh, okay, I guess we got an industry raid and a, another offshore mission. I think I want to do this one first. By the way, you can see in the corner there the alignment, so that's who you're doing the mission for. So apparently that's how I can tell if I'm doing a mission for Steiner or Davian. Uh, so that's, uh, I guess, a good thing. I don't think there's any time limit on these, so I'll just uh, do offshore A again then. It seems the militia navy isn't giving up so easy on the Transpax Deneb facility. Transpax is happy enough with our performance from last time that we are being offered first option on a renewed defense contract. Apparently I can now have a secondary lance, but there's a drop weight of 90 tons. In fact, I don't even think I can bring all my mechs in. Uh, interestingly enough. So, you have the option, I guess, now, uh, of either bringing some big fat mechs or a lot of little mechs. Uh, and I've actually sold most of my mechs, so these two are crippled. Um, I don't think I was actually dri- I don't think anybody was driving either of those. I think these are salvage. Uh, but we now just got the Bushwhacker. And I decided to equip the, uh, Light Goss, some medium, uh, X-Pulse lasers or whatever, uh, and, uh, two C-Strike missiles. And at light goss, I could put on the heavy goss, uh, sorry, not heavy, but the, the bigger goss, but I, I decided to try this out. Um, apparently it's just like, it does the same amount of, it's just a little bit less damage for more ammunition, and it's lighter. Uh, but it does less damage, kind of thing. It's it's weird. Um, I've never really tried it, so I figured, why the fuck not? Uh, this is the best mech in the, by the way, the free market right now. Uh, and so for my lance mates, I have a, I, in fact, I can't even bring all these mechs, I don't even know who I'm going to bring. This guy's a... Klein LB-10X, some medium pulse lasers on that guy, uh, we got a Hellhound here with, uh, what's this guy got? Uh, just some large pulse lasers, some small ones, and a Klein LRM-10, or 15, sorry. And the last guy is, uh, I put on the big-ass missile rack and two large pulse lasers. Actually, I, uh, speaking of which, I want to actually talk to you, with you about something. Um, this... This missile rack, it's, uh, I was confused on what it said, like it's CSMRM. That's Clan Strike Medium Range Missile. Nobody told me that. I kind of figured it out after I watched my video the second time of me talking about that. Uh, I was confused. It's basically, it has a lock-on, like the Sea Strike missiles. Uh, like, like the Streak missiles, basically. Um, and, but it's medium range, so it's kind of weird. Uh, the only question is, this sort of thing is 90 tons. Uh, I have 55 here. So that means I can only equip a... Uh, a 35 ton mech now, I think. I don't know what the heck that means though, when it says drop weight 90 tons. Let's have a look. Let's just, I'm gonna try and put all my like mechs on and see what happens. Oh, drop weight, I see. Okay, so there's no limit. It's just telling me how much I'm fucking putting in. Okay, I was a bit confused there. I thought that was a limit. I'm like, oh, am I reaching that limit? Sorry, as I've said, I, I haven't actually played through this game all the way, so I don't really know. Uh, so I don't have a secondary lance, obviously. Actually, you know what, you guys want to try that? Like, let's, let's do this. Mags is going to be with me. And, uh, I'm going to see what the, how the hell the secondary lance works, because I've actually never tried it. So this guy can have the, uh, Hellhound, which is the best mech I have on the other side. You can have Shredder, because uh, I want Mags with me. Her annoying voice is, uh, obviously bringing much, much into my, my heart. Um, and I think that's basically it of what I've done, so let's get started on this. Welcome back, Spectre One. Nice to have someone we can count on backing us up. Some of the other units rotating through here have been less than reliable. Sorry to hear that, Control. Looks like you've seen some action since we left. Roger that. Let's get your lance out on patrol in the harbor area. We know the destroyers are bold in Harrington and around maneuvers in the region. We've had a few skirmishes with lighter watercraft, but since we upgraded our primary turrets to Calliope's, they haven't come too close. Acknowledge. Moving to harbor. Castle, this is Spectre. Any word on available air support? Affirmative, sir. I've coordinated for a flight of stilettos to provide close support on the operation. Excellent. Remind me to work out an appropriate bonus for you. Why, you already have, sir. Signed and dated this morning. Close up and form on me. Roger. Enemy vessel group moving on western dock. We need support at Alpha. Over. Moving to Alpha. Light them up, people. Roger. They won't get far. Bring Calliope's online. Roger. Roger, lead. Roger, lead. Engaging a half dozen watercraft. Squad of hovers making for the shoreline. Roger. Roger, lead. Nav point Delta. 
reach. So I can kind of tell you how this works now. Uh, essentially, I now have to press like F10 to order everybody. It, they look they look like they work exactly the same as the other lands. I just made detected. this worse for myself, essentially. So maybe I'll tell Enemy that detected. other lands to go to nav point beta or something. I don't know. They could just defend it. Uh, yeah, there we go. Go to my nav point. Copy. So, and Mags is gonna stay on me. Close up and form on me. Roger. Uh, let's see, I got a light gauze, so let's click this asshole out. Spectre 1, the second wave is moving in on Eastern Dock. We mark both destroyers moving in to support their attack. Immediate support needed at nav point beta. Castle, let's get those stilettos in here, double time. Harpy, you are go for interdiction. Assume attack vectors. Roger, Harpy inbound on destroyer group. Contact minus three zero seconds. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Oh, what the heck is this? Okay, so I think I I think we have to split up between two Enemy points. Enemy detected. Kind of wish I had a faster mech, Enemy actually. Enemy detected. Calliope one is offline. Uh, it's, he's referring to the, the missiles. It's the Calliope. Oh, there's our stilettos. So we have air support. Nice. All right, let's go fuck up this this boat. Oh, it's just a destroyer. Yeah, I picked a mech without a fucking jetpack this time. Jump jets, not jump jetpack. And so I, have, I have some fucking close range missiles, which I, I think I entirely missed them. Nav point reached. So they're they're over there. They should defend. Warning: heat exceeding recommended level. Enemy detected. Heat level critical. Shut down imminent. Enemy detected. Mm -hmm. Enemy detected. Oh great! I had to shut down. Harpy returning for refuel and rearm. Hope we helped. Roger. Thanks for the flyby, Harpy. Spectre out. Is Meg still with me right now? All right. So I know there's a lot of detected. purists probably wondering why I play this game in third person. And it's because first person is like, I don't know. Target destroyed. I, I guess I could play this in first person. It's fine. I Target I don't know destroyed. why, but I got used to Mech Four in in uh, in, in third person for some reason. I, it just doesn't feel like it handles particularly well. It's like an emergent thing. People are like, you know. I think the other thing is that when you're watching, you can't exactly tell. Like, unless you're, like, a really big fan, you can't tell where my torso is looking. Uh, so, like, I'm gonna circle strafe this guy, for example, and it's kind of disorienting. Not for me as much, but more for, probably for you. Because that thing below my crosshair tells me how I'm fucking looking at him. So, it's like, I don't know. It's like, it's, I mean, it's either, either one, guys. It's, it's, I think it's fine, but does, as I said, there's diehard fans who are like, fuck third person. It's all about the first person. Because that's how, like, you know, controlling the mech would actually be. All naval forces destroyed. Harbor secure. Damn fine work, Commander. Hopefully we won't have to fend off those pirates again. We'll see, Control. They seem pretty determined to bring this place under militia control. It's quiet for now, sir. Best get your lamps back and be briefed. ASAP. Roger. En route. Spectre out. That's the second time we've secured Deneb Station, Commander. I picked up word from local sources that Admiral Carrington is bringing in mech support to make an example of the Transpax facility. Transpax has several calls in with us regarding another defensive engagement. Ah, uh, David hates me. All right. Uh, well, I guess I might as well just go straight to the next mission. I don't think I got anything new. It's still the same problem. Actually, it says uh, we haven't actually repaired anything. It's just stuck there perpetually forever. I guess until I travel somewhere. You know what? I'm I'm starting to realize something about this game. I don't think time time passes. What the fuck? A urban mech is here. Holy shit! Urban mechs. Are these things that slow as shit? The cloud version is faster, but I can't ca carry large weapons. The fuck? There's also commando and the solitaire. I'm just looking at the mechs right now. I I I oh Razorback. There we go. Fucking, okay, whatever, we're done with this. We're not fucking bringing any of these. Uh, no need to change anything. I think this is fine. Even though that mission was super short. So let's go back to orbital view and industry this raid. This sabotage contract is pretty straightforward. We need to drop their power grid and take out the objective buildings. The Black Cobra mercenaries defending the base have a mix of light and medium mechs in the area. A prolonged engagement could go badly for us. Use discretion in engaging them head on. So, 
I, I, I still have no idea why it tells me about my drop weight. I don't know if it's more expensive or what the fuck goes on. Let me see. What, what if I... Ah, there's the drop fee. Ah, so the more mechs I bring, the less money I get. Yeah. Hey, you know, you gotta, you gotta, forgive me, I'm kind of learning some of this stuff. So, we learned what the secondary lance does, and it's essentially nothing, because it's like, I guess it's just a way for me to command them, because I, I commanded them to go to the dev point beta immediately. I, I guess that's how you make it work, um, but you're still commanding them all the same, so, let's right, let's go. Initial recon of the base spotted a hole in the turret defense grid north of the complex and east of your current position. If you head directly to nav point Alpha, you should get a good approach on the base without triggering their defenses. Roger, Control. Is Bird Dog still in the area? Unknown. At least one of the defending mechs has a Beagle active probe and has been on perimeter patrolling their vicinity. Bird Dog went power down and radio silence an hour ago. Copy. We'll keep an eye out for them. Okay, Spectre Lance. Form up on me and give a ready report. This is Meg. Ready up. This is Hannibal. Ready up. Ready up. Intel reports we're up against Burr's Black Cobras. They're a hodgepodge merc unit with a couple of mixed, medium, and heavy lances. All reports indicate only their medium assets are in the area, but you never know. Stay sharp. Wait, are we supposed to evade them? Because I, I see Navpoint Alpha over there. I kind of just want to kill them, though. I, I may have missed that part of where I was supposed to evade shit. Target destroyed. <laughs> Whatever, fuck it. Target destroyed. Yeah, they got like panzers there. Fuck that shit. Roger that. Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Oh god, the bushwhackers. So I kind of wish I pumped some points into speed for this thing. Holy shit. It's like we're already getting that point where everything's fucking slow. Also, Enemy I missed jump detected. jets. Enemy detected. We need, we need some Target catapults destroyed. though. I want to make an LRM boat again. Enemy we're we're getting that point, trust me. Specter engaging Black Cobra medium lance. This is Lieutenant Dunman of the Black Cobras. You're outclassed here. Stand down and we'll let you leave with your mechs. Ha! We'll leave with our mechs, all right. And yours, strapped to a salvage track. Commander, we don't have to take out the Black Cobras on this run. You can take out the buildings and exit the mission area. Roger, Control. I'm aware of the mission parameters. Check them out, dude. <laughs> Fuck these guys. Cease fire, that's a friendly. Oh no, I missed. Okay, let's just fucking sea strike this guy. Let's just Take focus this designated guy. Target. Roger Spectre. Copy. Roger six. I mean we brought like we brought a lot of mechs in for this, so let's do this. Nav point gamma breached. So I think I think later Target on it'll make a difference. Target eliminated. Target's destroyed. Where's that motherfucking bushwhacker? Oh, there you are. Who the fuck do you think you are? Copy. Roger that. Copy. Warning. Beat exceeding recommended level. Okay, this guy has LRMs and shit, so... He's got an, a he's got an AC-10, though, which is kind of worrying. Alright, let's kind of get away from him a little bit. I, I want to kill these guys. Like, why else would we drive battle mechs if not to fucking battle mech shit? So I guess some more shit I could talk about is this game's re-release, which is kind of Target interesting. Destroyed. Target eliminated. Target destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger. Copy. Roger six. Uh, basically, in like a couple years ago. Punch in out. You fucking got your mech destroyed. Holy shit. That's coming out of your paycheck there, uh, fucking Shredder. Shredder is actually shit, so, you know what? I'm actually not entirely surprised things worked out that way. That's okay, you know what? You know what? We should get some decent salvage from this. I'm trying to be an optimist, okay? Okay, fuck these mechs anyways. I'm playing on fucking Warning. better anyways. Warning, exceeding recommended level. I don't know what my other mechs are doing, though. I mean, this is a kind of difficult mission, so, you know what, we can forgive them for that. Can this guy just die? Um, so this game was, like, re-released for free, so it actually is technically a free game. Target's destroyed. 
Uh, let's see. Who else do we have? Oh, actually, what? This guy's been shooting us this entire time. Destroyed. Take out the designated target. Look, this guy got stuck on the wall. Roger. Mech warrior. Shit, he hit me. I'll never live it down. We should get like some really awesome salvage from this. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Close up and form on me. Copy. Roger, lead. I think that's the factory, or as the factory. So it was re-released, and it had a bunch of mech packs included with it, and some other shit. So it, it was actually pretty cool uh, what they did with this. So it was nice that they re-released it, which means if you actually want to play this, it is free. Now like it's not even. Beta. Like it's not even, it's not even some situation of, oh shit, you know, what if, like, I get caught with it. No, it's free, dude. It's fine. So, you know, it's, it's, it's quite nice, but it was abandoned again shortly after, so... And it doesn't even work that well in modern upbringing systems. I really wish that, they, like, the mech games would go on, like, GOG or something, because GOG keeps them up to date and shit like that. Warning. How long does this thing take to kill? Level. Take out the designated target. Roger, Lee. Warning. Roger. Intex Generator is history. Level. Turrets are offline. Objective buildings destroyed. The fuel depot should be close to Gamma. Run a close sweep on the point. I guess I missed that. So, I, as I said, this is like... Like, you know what? Normally with these old games, like, nobody, I think, ever has been sued for downloading... I think even a new game, I don't think companies really care if you fucking pirate it. Just slap on more DRM or some stupid shit. Um, but like these old ones, like as I said, you just torrent it or whatever. But this one is actually free. Because a lot of these games you can't actually find, like a lot of these older ones, you can't actually find through any other means other than uh, to, to, to pirate them, you know? Which is like, you know, it's, it's, it's not like, it's nobody's fault. It's just like, well, who knows who owns the rights these days? I have no idea where the fuel depot is. I just see vehicle hangers and a radio tower. She said Gamma. We're at Gamma, right? It may take a while, guys. Maybe it's like down here. She's like, do a sweep. See, that's a fuel truck. Fuck that. Oh, there it is. Okay, it's behind the mountain. Close up and form on me. Roger, Spectre. Copy. Castle. Spectre reporting mission successful. Let's get a salvage team in here to pick up mechs and strip those turrets. Affirmative, sir. Salvage is en route. Kovati is very pleased with the mission report, Commander. The corporate VP wanted me to pass on a message. Quote, it's nice to see mercenaries who can get the job done. Fucking two bushwhackers? Holy shit. Okay, that's insane. Um, yeah, we just, like, that was a good idea to actually kill all those guys. Signer must be pleased. We get a bunch of crap weapons from that. Nice. Um, what the fuck? Well, how do I lower it? How, lower my fucking... This represents your two best lances that you can field for your employer. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's that's because like my mechs got destroyed. They got fucking wrecked. Uh, let's see. We got time for I think one more. Holy fucking shit! Uh, what else do we have on this planet? We still have one more. Um, so let's first have a look at the next mission. Looks like the hornet's nest is busted wide open. Admiral Carrington is calling for the complete destruction of the Transpax Coastal Facility Deneb. He's enlisted mercenary mech support from the remaining Black Cobras. My best estimate is that they will be ready to strike in the next two weeks, a month at the outside. Transpax has made it clear we are their first choice unit and are offering double pay for harbor defense. Nice. So it's like this mission is just over and over again. We just did some Steiner shit on the side. All right, I'm going to be in the mech lab for, I think, a little while. Um, well, let's actually see. Do we get any new chassis? We got uh, an Argus. Uh, our first heavy, actually. Uh, interesting. I'm debating if I want to buy this. I, you know, I guess so, because I think we can finally retire some of these other ones. By the way, um, if a mech is being repaired, I cannot sell it. That's just kind of how, how things work. And I could also sort it by Shadow Cat. Jump Jets. 45 tons? Okay, I'm gonna stop that. Uh, I wish I, I wish I could fucking have a jump jet mech now. I mean, I don't think... Uh, the thing is, I can't really tell by this thing what kind of mech it is, so... We're gonna buy this guy. Let's see, let's see what this guy's about. And also, I, I think I should get rid of Shredder now, because I think Shredder's trash. But I have nobody else. 
But I want to replace him. Yeah, now let's let's find someone else. Bullseye. Do, do we want bullseye? Is the question. I mean, he's got fucking 95 uh, ability for that. No. Let's get a. Uh, let's get someone else. Maybe. Nah, uh, I guess bullseye. Fuck Angel. Angel sucks. Look, look at Rufus. Poor Rufus. He never even went on our mission. Fuck you, Shredder. Get out. Get the fuck out of here. I saw you were pi piling that mech. You piece of shit. Let's get Bullseye in here. Where's Bullseye? There you go. Oh, look, it's Goof. Fun loving young warrior. Excited one oft oftentimes inappropriately reverse over the comm. Oh shit. I think I want Goof. Uh, now we want to fucking. We, we want him to not destroy all our mechs, you know? So, let me go fuck around in the mech lab for a bit. Oh, actually, no, no, wait, never mind. Uh, let's look at what the Argus is about. Uh, it's a lot about machine guns. Wow, well, I'm gonna have to do a lot to this thing to make it fucking usable. But, uh, and there's no jump, there's literally nothing here, look at this. Literally fucking nothing. Anyways, I'm gonna go fuck around in the mech lab, I'll be back in a bit. Alright, so I made a... Argus that oh by the way I changed everyone's skins. I didn't change anybody else. I just changed this one uh, Goss and two large pulse lasers the big Goss Not not no little Goss for me anymore. So that's all we're gonna do Also, I don't think I can really increase my speed anymore. Actually, I probably could if I dumped a bunch of uh, Like if I like I can dump armor about like this, but I don't think I want to do that actually. I don't even know how- uh, actually, you know what? I totally can increase my speed. Not by much, though. Not by much. But we will do that, and we'll put one more heat sink back in. Alright, that's all I'm gonna do with that. Uh... So, that's all we're gonna do. And Bullseye's got the bushwhacker now. Transpax has begun a full evacuation of the facility until this matter is resolved. A skeleton crew is manning Deneb control and has the Calliope grid patched up and functional. Deneb, this is Spectre. You on the comm? Uh, uh, affirmative. This is Corporate Officer Second Class Smidlin. Lowest brass on the totem pole, eh? Don't worry, Smidlin. We aren't looking to lose this fight. Roger. I have the Calliope's online. Radar given mostly static. I have a good SATCOM link. I'll provide positional data for the operation where I can. All right, so what are we doing? Okay, Spectre Lance, give a ready report and keep one eye on your scanners. We're expecting combined naval and mech aggressors. This is Bullseye. Give me a target. Contact. 900 meters. Dude, he's like, he's like Russian. Roger. Roger, Six. Roger, lead. We're talking about them to go to the other nav point. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? So... So far, this entire mission has been just me, like, killing Target ships destroyed. like this. Target destroyed. Have we ever even faced a fucking Target mech? Destroyed. Right, uh, I'm gonna say... Uh, I wish I could actually see what I've ordered people to do. But I can't. Okay, uh, Meg's gonna form up on me. Roger that. Uh... Whoops, I, I, I want to fucking get rid of this thing. I can't. I, I pressed F4 by accident, now wants, it wants to or, it wants me to order the more. That point reached. Close up and form on me. Roger that. Copy. Roger lead. Attack your closest target. Roger, Spectre. Roger, Roger, Spectre. Oh, they all went over there. Oh, shit. No, I need to goss this guy. Yeah. Fuck that kid. Alright, goss this guy too, except I can't hit him. See, this, these, you see, these guys are destroying the fucking... The, the shit I'm trying to protect. And I cannot let that stand. I assume this is the infamous Spectre? This is Spectre? There's some reason you need an introduction? Dragonfly here. Just wanted to make sure I was swatting the right fly. I'm gonna make you pay for Lieutenant Dunman's lance. You're welcome to try. Spectre out. Oh, All shit. Units be advised. Militia, heavy choppers moving in from the east. Castle, any chance of getting Harpy in here? Negative, Commander. Their dance card is full for now. I will update if situation changes. Looks like we're doing this without air support. Maintain good air watch. Nav point beta reached. Cobras lost their bite? 
Your reputation had me expecting more. This isn't over. Colonel Burr has a lot of friends. You will pay. I will pay. Dude, that's a lot of fucking- that's a big-ass lance there. Uh, and I was just saying to myself, actually, they're, you know what, they're, they're shit, actually, never mind. I was a little bit worried, and then I became not worried. Actually, they're distracted a whole lot by... Wow, our, you know what, our fucking mechs are bad. Carrier Harkness has launched two fighter wings. Nightshades inbound. Over. Roger, Castle. Still tangling with the Cobras. Target destroyed. I didn't even realize this, but they're fucking dog shit, actually, so it's fine. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Just like destroying them all. Enemy detected. Why was I even worried about this? Enemy detected. There's a lot enemy of shit detected. stuff. Enemy Target detected. Destroyed. Enemy detected. Guys, I'm not sure if enemies are detected. Still not sure. How many Target of these things destroyed. are there? Holy shit, nightshades. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. <laughs> Basically, okay, that one just went into me. Roger, Spectre. Copy, copy. We should be okay. It's the Uzeals have a bit Tascom of a. Uh, area clear of hostiles. Looks like we did it again, sir. Transpacks could have saved themselves a mint in evacuation fees if they'd had more faith in us. I'm sure they're plenty happy either way. Target destroyed. Target eliminated. Target destroyed. Excellent work, Commander. Merknet is already buzzing with the news of taking down the Black Cobras. It seems someone leaked a battle rom of the conflict. The Admiral has been relieved of command, and his replacement has negotiated a truce with Transpax. I think he's afraid we'd start mounting counter strikes. That clears up the missions here on Halloran. Consult your star system overview to plot our next move. Alright, we're actually done here, uh, oddly enough, which is really nice, and we got still more, more mechs out of this. Look at, me, look at me of these I need to fucking repair. Actually, I need to select all- Oh, I, I, I have to repair them all. Holy shit, I don't, even, I don't even have enough money to repair them all. Because I can't get rid of them until... I guess I, ha I have to repair them in order to sell them, because nobody wants to buy a broken mech. And it costs money to do it, so... I did not realize that. I'm not gonna sell all this. I need more money, though, so... Uh, I'm just gonna decide on some things to sell here. Like, we don't need that. We got climb tech now for a lot of this shit, so. Uh, like, AC5, fuck that. Nobody wants that shit. We got Ultra AC stuff. Maybe we want the AC10, though. Oh, well, we have Ultra AC10, so never mind. Okay, so I didn't quite realize that part. Uh, it still costs a shit ton. Uh, you know what? Let's sell one of these mechs here that we don't want. Like, maybe the Hellspawn or... No, Chimera. Chimera can go. Alright. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna select all of these. Uh... Why is it suddenly cheaper now to repair them? I guess the Chimera... I guess that Chimera was something I could repair. Okay, well, we we'll repair them all. Uh... Okay, so we're not gonna advance time. Okay, I didn't actually realize that part until now. But that's fine, it's not like it really set us back, because I was wondering why this shit wasn't repairing. So now we go to Star Systems, uh, nothing in Outreach, and now we can start Solaris, or we can go to Eaton. Uh, and this is Jungle Light, uh, first season. So I guess, it, I guess time does progress when I am doing missions. So I think we're gonna go, oh, apparently it's free to go to Solaris though, but I, I would want a Puma mech, so... Let's uh, let's go to Eaton first. Apparently this is neutral, but I'm going I'm going to just refuse to do missions that is against Steiner, I guess. I mean, you can technically, I think someone said you can do them all, and then in Solaris you can dedicate uh, all your victories to Steiner. But I don't know, whatever. Let's go. Let's go over here then. This also means though that all my mechs should get repaired now. There should be literally nothing left that, like, needs repairs. Yeah, like, oh, holy shit, dude. Okay, dude, we got a lot of things to sell. Look, look at this fucking wolfhound and, Uz well, Uziel's will keep. Uh, Owens. Owens is like, yeah, you know, I'll keep the Owens for, um... I'll keep the Owens for the mech, uh... Uh, the fucking arena, because that sounds kind of fun, the Owens. Like a different kind of mech, but a lot of this crap I'm gonna get rid of. So let's see, all the light mechs. Okay, get rid of the wolfhound. Sell that guy. 
By the way, it automatically strips the mechs, uh, so it's kind of something interesting to note. Uh, we don't need chimeras anymore. I think we're past that now. We'll keep the Uzeals though. Hellspawn, get rid of that. Hellhounds, not sure about. Eh, fuck it. Get rid of them. Actually, you know what? Those are expensive guys. It's a... I, I, oh, it's because they're clan. That's why. I don't have any assaults, obviously. Oh, catapult! Oh, shit! Dude, it's it fucking started. Oh god, a catapult. Man. And we're gonna get a puma mech, because I'm gonna show you guys how that works. There's also, we got a Thanatos. Um, nobody cares about Thanatos, though. That's a crap mech. No, it's all about the catapult, kids. Alright. Um, I'm either gonna, I, I kinda wanna get rid of them both. Let's, let's decide right now. Uzeal. I, usually I cut this shit out, but, like, this is actually kinda neat, so. For a change. Uh, or Hellhounds. So Hellhounds have these kinds of hit po points, and this... Oh, wow, the fucking Uzeal, I think, is better, actually. Because we got to get rid of one of the chassis guys, so might as well be the fucking... Might as well be the Hellhounds. Alright. Now we're rich. We got 28,000 sea bills. 28 million or something sea bills. Alright, so Catapult is um, pretty good in its default state. Artemis 4. Uh, by the way, I have no recollection of this whatsoever. And apparently, that, that doesn't put it back on. How does that work? Oh, I see. It's a, it's a separate kind of, they're Artemis 4, uh, missiles. So, it's a tracking system for more accuracy, which is interesting. Uh... And apparently reactive armor on this guy and be Galacta Pro, which is nice. So these guys are fucking crazy. Like I'm gonna I'm gonna actually have a lot of fun in this guy. Um, I'm gonna be using this guy for a while, I can guarantee you that now. Uh, to sh just to show you some of the other mechs we got. Uh, we got the Pumba. The fuck is this? Whatever, I I'm gonna fuck around with this later. Uh, the Pumba is this guy. Overpowered piece of shit. Look at this, two ER PPCs. Moral Ferberus, we can get AMS on here. Seven heat sinks, top speed 90, 93. Holy shit, dude. Like, like that's that's bullshit. Two PPCs on this guy? Fuck that. That's ridiculous. We're gonna use this guy in Solaris, by the way. I'm gonna do Solaris soon. Uh, and I think that's all we got. Was it? Yeah, that's all we got. So that's, that's, uh, that's some bullshit right there. So let's see if we got any good weapons either. Um, targeting laser. Small laser, close to null damage, but useful as a target de designator. Do I want this? I don't think I want this. Oh, dude. Okay, now we got a rocket launcher. Um, unguided rockets. All right. Uh, we got some more clan LRMs. Nothing with Artemis yet, though. Uh, d that's only what came with my fucking catapult mech. Uh, some narcs, more sea strikes. Uh, get some. Well, we got a clan LC a AC20. So that's, that's, well, LBX AC20. That's basically super shotgun. Heavy Goss. Here we go. This is, I'm pretty sure, uh, this is a lost tech weapon. We want both of these. Because that's a big fucking gun, guys. That is a big, big fucking gun. Like, look at that. Like, 29 damage. 18, then 29. Holy shitballs, dude. And it actually doesn't weigh that much more than the Goss. How is this legal? Fuck, this is like buying like a fucking minigun or some shit from like the side shop, I swear to god. Alright, so uh, I, we're, we're, I'm gonna fuck around with this stuff later, but that's all the time we got for today, so take care guys. Bye.